Bate after bate after bate after bate Bate after bate Bate after bate Bate after bate Hi guys Welcome back to my YouTube channel Okay basically let me just give you a sort of breakdown in it As you can see I don't have lashes on Obviously I don't really wear makeup on my channel anyway but let me just give you a, a full rundown in it. If my rule number one, if my hair's not done, I'm not coming out. Two, when I get my hair done, like three days later, okay, cool. You know, like girls, obviously, you like some of your lace starts lifting or whatever. I'll do the little touch ups, but you see when the wig is completely off, it's time to get a new wig. Not a wig, new wig, but it's time to get my hair done again. I don't. I like my hair fresh and if it's not fresh then I've got this on or a hat like generally speaking I just feel like that's how I that's how I've turned in to be it's really bad but yeah that's it anyway today we are doing a would you rather challenge I asked on Instagram and I put it on my snap um if people could send me questions I've got my iPad here obviously it's the old ipad because i don't really feel like i need a new ipad it, it does the same thing do you get it <clears throat> so yeah i asked instagram and snapchat if they could send me some would you rather questions and yeah they well i summarized 15 questions because people actually sent a lot of questions but the thing is i put it on instagram and i said be quick because i'm filming a lot today and obviously people sent them last minute so i kind of mixed and match with like internet questions and questions and i summarized them to 15 questions so let's get ready to rumble ah, 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 ah. oh my god i actually got adhd i'm sure of it. i'm so sure of it right first question would you rather hello please if you've been rocky with me since i've done that valentine's q a yeah you would know reading is not my forte hello i don't i don't like reading under pressure like someone else read it for me in it so that was fine but uh, now i'm gonna have to read that on so it's a bit it's a bit much would you rather be 10 minutes late or 20 minutes early me i'm always early like nah man my what's it called i was gonna say attendance punctuality my punctuality has been bad has been so fucking bad lately like i've been late to work late to dinners late to everything but the thing is the old chanel would say yes like i would rather be 20 minutes early if it's an interview man bang on time because I, I need that job be need that scondooly need that bread all right shout out to Stardog clothing by the way this the tea i'm gonna put the link below so y'all can get it they got nice gym sets they got t-shirts they got everything like i actually love their brand anyway so the answer to question number one is i would rather be 20 minutes early it just sets the tone you know it just sets the tone question number two would you rather lose one year of your life or be in jail for one year i'm guessing but i don't understand that question though what, what do you mean by lose one year do you mean like die early or be in jail for a, a year <laughs> no one wants to fucking die he's lot of deep <laughs> no one wants to die um i would say be in jail i guess but someone would say losing jail obviously in hindsight lo being in jail is basically losing a year of your life in it but not necessarily because you're still alive like imagine saying you want to die early than rather be in jail that's a bit coffee <laughs> would you rather be married to a 10 with bad personality or a six with good personality first of all wouldn't really say that the people that i've dealt with are tens anyway um no disrespect to them but it's their personality that got me to get it. looks came after so 
me i'm used to sixes i can't lie no okay people are gonna think that that's mad rude and that i'm dissing people but i'm actually not like it's not that deep do you get it like it's actually not that deep because nah i've dated a few tens and their personality is shit so generally i'd rather be with a six me and you like, i'm not the prettiest girl in the world i ain't got lashes on so yeah it's a bit higgy hagger but no i think i'd rather be with a six do you know do you know how draining it is to be with someone with dead personality there's no response there's no response there's no response like i don't no response i don't get it. you're not responding Ah. anyway question number four would you rather have unlimited first class tickets or never have to pay for any restaurants again that that's a hard question but i would go with never having to pay for a restaurant again me i'm out every weekend eating this shit adds up <laughs> let me not lie to you this shit adds up and i don't have time for it so if god can give me unlimited free pass to any restaurant that i want to go be my guest because at the end of the day when you fly first class you're still getting there same time as economy you know i'm only saying that because side note basically i said to my best friend yeah our birthday is literally six days apart in it so i said to her next year obviously corona fucked on my birthday this year so next year we'll go somewhere nice but i said let's go first class in it let's just treat ourselves and she was like we're gonna get there the same time as economy that's the type of negativity that i don't like to deal with but you know at the end of the day what could i say eh? like it's true it's, it's true and this this question just proves it it's actually true question five would you would you rather be completely insane and be aware of it or completely insane and believe that you're sane i mean people would say that i'm actually insane and i think i'm sane but i take accountability for my actions i don't actually think i'm insane and no one's insane you can't be insane i just think it's a thing where <laughs> people like i don't know like people get me on the wrong side and then you you, you just bug me in it you're bugging me so i'm gonna do something mad now because you're bugging me like don't bug me that's it make me happy i won't need to shout standard question six would you rather have a partner or multiple partners i'm joking i didn't even say it i didn't even say anything I didn't even answer the question. I'm joking. I'd rather have one partner. Do you know how much? Do you know? <laughs> do you know how tiring it is entertaining more than one person that you're meant to like? like? So you're telling me that I'm meant to have multiple partners and I have feelings for each and every one of them. That's crazy talk. Don't do. Let, you sort of don't piss me off with these questions. Yeah, don't do it. <sighs> I have to take a breather. All this reading, answering, talking, clapping. I can't do it. That's Fenty Beauty. No, this is definitely not sponsored. 100% not sponsored. But at the end of the day, that's better. Okay, so the answer is obviously one partner. Wow. Wow, wow, again. Okay, cool. Yeah, so the answer is um, obviously I'd rather only have one partner. Like to have more than one is just, oh, God. What question are we on? question number seven okay would you rather get on top or be underneath <laughs> get on top of me and stop moving stupid this is what i just said like i just can't I'm not saying i'm lazy i'm me i mean <laughs> i'm joking <laughs> i definitely like like i just like that position more and it not being too prerogative because you lot are, i can see where these questions are going you just don't want to know too much now but um nah definitely get on top of me and stop moving stupid literally like <sighs> i just can't breathe so the answer to the question is i'd rather be underneath standard question eight would you rather do romantic shit or try new kinky stuff um I think I'd rather do romantic stuff because me, I wouldn't, okay, I wouldn't say I'm a kinky person in it, but I feel like 
I already exceed that expectation. So it's like, how much kinkier can we get, babe? <laughs> okay. But you know, some people, when you feel comfortable with someone in it, you explore a whole different board game. So probably, but I'd rather do romantic stuff than question nine. Would you rather go back to your ex or stay with someone that doesn't love you? Don't you understand? Both of them don't love me. Do you get it? Like, they don't love me. These niggas don't love me. They don't love me. And that's fine, but toodles. Because I'll be finding someone that does love me, bitch. <laughs> but, I'm joking. I'd rather go back to my ex. Simple factor of, obviously, you know, I'm not talking about a certain person, by the way um yeah not talking about a certain person by the way but you know like exes obviously you they were not saying they were ex for a reason but you was also together for however long like some people were together for only two days or whatever but the fact is you lot had once had a chemistry in it so i feel like going back to your ex that person knows you you know that person whether or not you lot ended it, it would just make sense like why am i gonna be with someone someone new that generally don't love me i just don't like because with exes i don't i don't really believe that they're 100 percent over you i don't believe it especially in this generation like boys like to lie and like oh fuck my ex blah blah, blah. but at the end of the day like do you get it half of the time these you're getting back together with your ex so i think everyone should just bake off with the whole ex talk and i hate that person because it's just it's jarring now question number 10 would you rather wear the same trainers oh my gosh people are texting me fuck would you rather would you rather wear the same pairs of trainers every year or get or get new trainers every single day do you know how flipping expensive trainers are and especially the trainers i wear sorry not saying that I wear some exclusive trainers in it, but my trainer collection is quite good. You you sort of saw me do the video the other day. Like, if I add up the total of all them trainers, <laughs> I've spent a lot. Do you get it? I've generally spent a lot. So that's not what we're going to do. Um, but then again, not one trainer will go with all my outfits. So that's, thing, that's the thing that I actually need to think about, boy. Do you know what? Fuck it. I'll get trainers every day in it. Like, I can't, I can't, I can't deal with the one boot all year. I can't deal with the one shoe all year. I cannot do it. No, sir. No, me. <laughs> Would you rather quit YouTube or become a full time rapper? You lot don't even know. I got bars, B. I've actually got bars. Don't play with me. On God, don't play with me. I've got bars. Like, not i'm not quitting youtube like i'm generally not quitting youtube in it but i have got bars you don't get it like you actually don't get it but you know what yeah one day i'm gonna film a rap battle you are gonna know something then boy i'm gonna come with all the smoke i've got a diss track in my notes i've got a love tune i got i got i got i got a get money remix you know when like tupac done that wait was it tupac get money it was biggie you know when Biggie done that, get... <sighs> Listen, Nels Official got bars in it. Period. Question 12. Question 12. <laughs> this is why I need to go back to uni. Would you rather go on a blind date or go on a date with someone it ended really badly with? Mm. I'm trying to think of the person it ended really bad with and if I want to see that person again. Ugh. Or if I would go on a blind date with someone that I don't know. Me, I'm a quite friendly person, but also I get social anxiety, like when I feel uncomfortable. So if I was to go on a blind date and the person wasn't, not my type, but I just didn't see us like getting into anything too deep, then I'd rather go on a nigga. I'd rather go on a date with the nigga that wanted to smash my head in not saying like someone wanted to smash my head in but like the anger in it yeah i think i just go on a date with someone it ended badly within it 13 question 13 are you listening question 13 would you rather go on holiday with your mum or dad mm. <laughs> my mum and dad are two very diverse people but they have the same like 
they're different but they're the same like that's why my personality is very whoo -hoo, because my mum I think it's because I live with my mum why I think I think to myself yeah I could go on a holiday with her but then again I the way my mum grills me sometimes yeah I'm not even on it like I'm actually not on it but then my dad he's fire like he grills me as well like my dad's very fun though that's one thing i can say like i went to dubai with my dad for my 19th birthday i think it was my 19th birthday and i swear to god that was the littiest holiday ever ever and that was my first time going to dubai i went to dubai last year but that was my first time going to dubai oh my god when i told you me and my dad me and my dad have fun like daddy me and daddy have fun we do and I know you're watching this, Dad. Big up you and I left. Okay. Question 14. Would you rather have six kids or or no kids at all? Um, fun fact, I don't want kids. Um, yeah, I actually don't want kids. I just don't feel like I have the responsibility mechanism to withhold that type of big responsibility in it. Shout out to all the mums and the dads, because I rate you a lot highly, but me, I could never do it in it. Like I just don't feel like I want kids. But the thing is, I've always said, if I do have kids, I, like, I pray to God it's a little girl. So it's just me and my girl. That's it, innit? Like, just us two. Obviously, it would be nice to have, like, a family. My boyfriend there. Ugh. But, you know, I'm, like, just please give me my daughter. That's it, like, literally. But to answer the question, I'd say no kids at all. Six kids coming out of my vagina have some respect have some respect i won't be tired anymore and that's the problem <laughs> okay this is the last question guys question 15 would you rather do doggy for the rest of your life or never have sex again <sighs> that is such that's such a hard question <laughs> doggy for the rest of your life do you know what that means no back no back no back i wouldn't have a back <laughs> i wouldn't have a back no that's crazy so uh, who asked that question the fuck no nah, that's actually mad crazy what the hell doggy for the rest of my life like no other positions but then no sex for the rest of my life fuck. that is crazy i'd just say doggy please my needs need to be met hello it's for the rest of my life that means i really can't have kids <laughs> that means i really can't have kids boy anyway that was question 15 um that concludes the would you rather challenge with nails official of course um i hope you guys enjoyed it remember to like comment and subscribe on what videos whoa whoa remember to like comment and subscribe in it so yeah that's it i'm out deuces Bate after bate after bate after bate Bate after bate